Last night I went over to my parents' house to visit for a little while. My dad gave me something he found on the street. Well, I'll let you take a look at it and decide for yourself. Yes, this is a homemade fishing rod with a modified fishing reel. They, uh, <clears throat> it's a, a regular push button spin caster and they took part of a beer can and taped everything up and I'm not sure what this plastic thing is but they uh, cut a hole through it so the line would go through basically made a new cover for the spinning spin caster and then the, the rod is not at all a fishing rod it's a solid metal like there's no barely any flex to it uh, uh, apparently it's missing half the rod because I imagine that's what they did. They made it into a, they you found something that looked like a fishing rod and made it into one. And uh, yeah, the uh, the eyelid here is a piece of hard plastic straw that they taped there. And uh, the handle is not a handle. This is like a dog collar or something or a dog leash. I mean. Like the same material a dog leash would be made out of and uh, it's wrapped around a bunch of times and taped up to, for a handle so uh, somebody was pretty creative when they did this uh, it appears to work the reel I've tested it out a little bit and uh, I'm gonna challenge myself and try to catch a fish with this so yeah this is I've never seen anything like this. I would have never even thought about doing something like this. If I had half of a fishing reel, I wouldn't have thought to uh, build something around it, you know? So, uh, I'm going to challenge myself and see if I can catch a fish with this. Alright, it's been 20 degrees the last couple of days. And then all of a sudden today it's sunny and warm. Like, it's supposed to be in the 60s. But this feels like it's in like 75, almost 80. I'm not catching anything. I uh, haven't seen any fish, but uh, I think I figured out how they were working with this, this rod because they had this uh, socket tied on as a weight, but I figured out that it fits right over the end like that. So I think whenever they're casting out, you press the button and, you, and there you go. Well, this is where I wanted to originally fish because I know there's fish here. But there's people there. Kind of wish I was recording right now, but uh, I was just talking about how those people are in my spot. And I was walking down and there's some other guys that are trying to get into that same spot too. So they're fishing a little bit further down. And he cast out way too far over into their area and crossed their line. And he was reeling it in and he jerked it and ripped their rod into the water. He better hope he can get it back or he owes somebody a new rod.